Hey everyone, Trollbender here with Trolls Tech. Wanted to make an updated video on DLSS Swapper as the installation has gotten super simple. So we'll go ahead and cover that. First place you wanna to go to is the GitHub page where DLSS Swapper is. They're at version 1.0.31 now. I'll leave the link in the description below. You're gonna click on installer, download that sucker. Wait for it to download. Then go ahead and install it. This is gonna be pretty straightforward. You're gonna get this little error, Windows protected, just slide and hit run anyway. If you don't have to slide, that's fine. I think my uh, GUI settings are a little bit odd. Anyway, next, 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 install. All right, that was easy. We're gonna launch that bad boy. DLSS Swapper will only list games that are in Steam, apparently, so uh, I'm not sure if there's a way around that. I will experiment with that myself. You want to go to Library and uh, download the DLSS version of your choice. Then you're going to pick a game and pick a version of DLSS, and that's it. That's as quick as that is. I'm going to try Cyberpunk here. We'll go ahead and uh, 3.5 it, swap out. Bam! You now have an updated DLSS for those games. Super simple. If you want to reverse it, it's just the same process. To verify that it actually worked, you can do the old search for nvngx underscore dlss dot dll in your games folders, and it will find all the DLSS files. We did Cyberpunk, we're gonna verify that that is indeed 3.5. And look at that, 3.5. So DLSS Swapper has gotten super simple. We'll allow you to swap out DLSSs in some of those games. So enjoy, just wanted to drop that video for you. I appreciate you guys watching. Hit like and subscribe. I love you people.